the agent they murdered. You knew him? He was a friend of mine. Sorry for your loss. I could say it comes with a job, but it doesn't get any easier. No, it doesn't. Guess you've been down here a while? I've been living as Karen Bowman, international aid worker, for just about five years. It means living rough, but as a cover, it gets me out and about. At least it comes with a chopper. How'd you get in country? A flu in business class from Manaus. Hey, I'm refreshed and ready for work, right? I just hitched rides from Barranco, Peru. How about you? I got on board a bus in Huey, Argentina, and drank all the way to Via Zone. Nobody wants to deal with a drunk on the bus. That explains why you smell like ass. I've heard rumors about you guys. I was a rookie field officer in Moscow when the coup went down. There was talk you were involved? Nah, it must have been someone else. We were never there. It's not every day you get to meet an urban legend in the flesh. Huh, you should tell that to my kid. Maybe he'd listen when I tell him to take the trash out. Is it hard being someone who doesn't officially exist? You tell me, Karen Bowman, international aid worker. I'm sure you've seen the horrible, fucked up shit humans are capable of when there are zero repercussions. But let me tell you right now, no matter how you compartmentalize how you Desensitize, you can't prepare for El Sueño. He's got a religious street that rates pretty close to delusional. He's taken vows of poverty, chastity. If he's not in it for the chocha or the money, he's in it for the power. This joint task force is CIA, DEA, JSOC. I'm your resident spook for this ride. Welcome to Operation Kingslayer. Our briefing said there'd be a contention of locals. The Qatar is 26. They're a group of rebels who've been giving Unidad and Santa Blanca some resistance. We'll meet their leader, Pat Qatari, soon as we touch down. Bolivians have a long history of hating us Yankees, but this time, let's hope the enemy of my enemy will be my friend. But don't turn your back on him. I'm not going to. soldiers. This is the help you promised? That Sandoval promised? A single Yankee died, so you send a handful of soldiers. Hundreds of Bolivians have died from Santa Blanca's bullets. Where will my hundreds of soldiers come from? As Americans, we aren't here, remember? These soldiers are the best covert ops team our country has to offer. With their help, you won't need hundreds of soldiers. Are you familiar with the word Huber, Senora Bowman? Meet Pakatari, leader of the resistance group Kataris 26. We will be working with the rebels to destabilize Santa Blanca's organization. They've been fighting Santa Blanca and corrupt Bolivian officials for nearly six years now. We'll need to coordinate targets. There is no time for this. We have information on Amaru's whereabouts. Amaru? You found him? Amaru is one of the founders of the Kataris 26. More than that, her group is founded on his ideas. Without his theories of an agrarian proletariat, there would be no organized resistance against Santa Blanca and the corruption in our government. Amaru must be saved. If you were to assist my people, it would do much to earn my confidence. Where is he? We do not know exactly. We know he is in this province and that there is a Santa Blanca lieutenant who knows where he is. I'll put a call into the activity, see if they can dig more intel out of the airwaves. Start looking for that lieutenant and keep me informed of everything via sat phone. Good hunting. Saving Amaru is important to our cause, Yankee. Make sure you don't kill the Santa Blanca lieutenant before you get the chance to ask him questions.
Time to earn your pay, people. Put on your game faces. I tell you, I'm not too comfortable working with Pakatari and these rebels. Their kind of ideology always ends up with more bodies in the ground. What's your feeling on this op, Nomad? End of the day, this is a revenge mission. We need to focus and get this done quick before we get stuck between local politics and the firestorm of cartel bullets. First objective, track down that Santa Blanca lieutenant so we can find Amaru. Ooh, We got tangos. Danger close. Don't want to split the target. Switch to suppressors. Heads up, hostile presence. Got eyes on the target. Let's move. We spotted one with submachine guns. We're cool. We're cool. drone. Spotting another tango. I'm moving to position. Ready to fire. Opening fire on these fuckers. Enemy down. Hang back, that tango might spot you. Looks like we've riled them up. Get that quieto. Okay, we're still good. Here's the deal, asshole. You answer my questions, or I put a bullet in your gut and leave you to die in your own shit. No enciendas? Chill the fuck out, cabron. What do you want? Amaru, where can I find him? <laughs> you serious? That's what this is about? Sure thing. He's at Atoya Farm. Go on. Then you can see what we do to people who fuck with us. People like you. We need to get this done in a hurry. Amaru's an old man. He's not gonna last long under torture. Shit, if they've been working on him for a while, there's a good chance he's already dead. Maybe, maybe not. is a major player in the rebel movement. The cartel will keep him alive as long as they can to find out what he knows. We can't afford to take any chances. There's too much riding on this. Let's move. I'm getting a position. Good to go. Frag out. Let's get moving. The cartel isn't gonna wait around for us to track down and rescue Amaru. Hang on, I'll drive. Fuck, we're made.
got another Tango. Tango marked, but he's got a civilian nearby. Here's target number five. Coming up on a Toyo farm. Remember, a lot of these Sicarios are ex-military. ID your targets. If Amaru gets killed by a stray round, Operation Kingslayer will be dead in the water before it even starts. Let's go. Hang back before they spot you. Looks like they're feeling frumpy. I got a narco over here. There. And There's the a weapons case over here. Hold up. They're gonna see you. Okay, we're cool. Okay, all clear. Are you Amaru? What's left of him anyway? Come on, we're getting you out of here. Awesome. I can put this to use. Bad guys in the area. I got it. I'll fly. Ready to engage. Rattled somebody's cage. Where are you taking me? Back to your friends. Entonces Pacatari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros, the young fool. Take it up with him, senor. Yo, I got a weapons case here. Are you hurt? Santa Blanca is not the most gracious of hosts. These Aucas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us see. Their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not... Were not... Were their names Yuri and Polito? Si! Yuri and Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval while Sueño questioned him. I want them bad. We only saw run-of-the-mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's gotta know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Heads up. Bowman's file on Yuri and Polito is coming through.
That's the rundown on La Yuri and El Polito. They're a key part of Santa Blanca's security operation. Remember to check out Bowman's briefing on the chain of command. The guy in charge of security is El Muro, the wall. Personal bodyguard and childhood friend to El Sueño. El Muro's little brother is La Plaga. Nasty piece of shit. Very active on social media. Head Sicario for the cartel. The hunt starts now. We want Sueño, we gotta work our way up the hierarchy. The first targets are Yuri and Polito. We find the intel, we track them down, we take them out. is airborne. Marking an enemy. Got eyes on the... Tango. He's got a lot of back. Roger that. Move it. I got another. That's five. Say the word, boss. Tango down. Here's target number five. Nomad, I've got Pakatari on the line. Sounds like he needs our help. Put him through. Hola, compadre. I have a problem in Itaqua, and Bowman says you might be able to help. My people need help. There have been many losses to the cartel, and the horrors inflicted by Yuri believed to have broken their spirit. The fires of revolution have almost gone out. Spare me the rhetoric, Katari. Just tell me what you need. There is a cartel supply convoy passing through the province soon. Capturing it would give my people much needed supplies and restore their morale. Can you do this? Consider it done. We're taking orders from Pat Katari now? Katari needs this convoy. We are gonna give it to him. The more he depends on us to get shit done, the more we can get out of him in return. Ready to fire. Target down. Say the word. Gage. He's gone. This way. What do you want us to do? What the hell are you doing? Take cover. The document mentions an Unidad captain who sends prisoners to Yuri and Polito for interrogations. He's got to know where our lovebirds are, but he's sitting in an Unidad firebase. Got it, moving. See a second target. I got a third target. Ready. Call the shot. That's one down. You 
Yo te amo. Got another tango. I got a third. I got a target carrying submachine guns. Moving to position. Say the word. Get back before they make you. I'm shooting these fuckers. That was close. There's a cartel medal over here. It's gonna break some poor thugs hard to lose this. Frag out. Get some. The are the cage. Oh, here we go. They've seen us. We got a 20 in the garage where Pleto parks his sports car. We snag that, we snag his GPS. Maybe something there tells us where he and his girlfriend are. These supplies will buy us a lot of goodwill from the rebels. This metal has a coca plant on it. That's kind of cool. We've learned that an Unidad captain named Fuentes has been working with Yuri and Polito. Interrogate Fuentes and see what intel he can give us. Good to go.
Everybody hold up, we got hostiles in the Yo, area. Yo, eyes on the grunt. Point him out. Next to the checkpoint. Okay, this is the Unidad firebase. We're looking for the captain who's in contact with Yuri and Polito. We need the target alive. Roger that. Ooh, ah. Sniper up in the tower. Roger, let me get in position. Sniper, top of the tower. Ready to engage. Target eliminated. Drone is up. Got Super it. Up Move it. Tower. We got a grunt all by his lonesome. Right in the bunker. Ready. Call the shot. He's down. Here we go. Got it. Eyes on the Unidad captain. Tango number three. Okay, total what the hell is this? How's it going, fuckstick? Pendejos. You are dead. <laughs> Mierda. You may as well kill me now. I'm not talking, carajo! Well, that's your choice. But with a pair of sick fucks like Yuri and Polito, one day that might be you hanging from their ceiling. You can't trust them. It would be a relief if I took them out of your life. Look, I'm not a snitch, but let's just say, yeah, they freak me out. The thing is, they're not even in Itaqua. So call them back to Itaqua. Tell them you've got a package ready. Uh. Oye, Olito. I got a lamb ready for delivery. Un borrego. Vale. Hold up. There's a weapons case here. to position. 
Say the word. Engaging. Donde se metieron? Pakatari's rebel movement is now that a couple are heading back to Itakwa. Wait. Three dead standing down. We're good to go. Now that our couple are heading back to Itakwa, all we need to do is find out exactly where the hell they're gonna be. Hostiles in the area, stay frosty. I got one narco. Over by the turret. I'm spotting another tango. Baby makes Heads up, we got a turret. I got another. That's five. Marking a hostile. It's close to some locals. This is the garage. Sound off is to spot Polito's car. Roger that. Heads up, we got a turret. I'm moving to position. With multiple civilians around. Good to go. That's one less bad guy. I'm seeing two narcos here, near the fuel drum. Back it up, they're gonna see you. Getting a position. Ready to fire. That guy's history. Down, you're giving yourself away. Yo, cartel gunman. I don't see him. Target number five. That whip's got an alarm. We've got a loc we've got a location on El Polito's personal car. Steal it, so our techs can analyze the car's GPS for intel. Hold 
the hornet's nest. Relax, we're still good. Got it, moving. Ready, call the shot. Got it. There it is. Eyes on Polito's car. This car is swanky. And there's a bloody condom in the glove box. Make that two bloody condoms. I guess that confirms it's Yuri and Polito's ride. Even if the condoms come standard, hold up. I'm opening fire. Eyes up. Let's get back to work. I never could understand an arc opening. You get an expensive whip, put chrome rims on it, but you just drive it around the same dusty times you were driving around before. You totally want one of these cars, don't you? Fancy car, fancy suit, still the same street, so what's the point? Air conditioning. Alright, now it's up to Bowman and the activity. They'll check the car's GPS for locations where Yuri and Polito may be hiding out. <laughs> 